Next question is from Mad Viking Brewing. Hey, Adam, my beers are always lacking that bright, hot flavor and aroma, always tasting bitter and muddled. I typically use three to five to one sulfate to chloride in my water. I dry hop for one day and cold crash for two, leaving the hops in the fermenter for three days total. I don't have her take pH. Could this possibly be a problem? He's doing the equivalent of 2.2 pounds per barrel or eight grams per liter. He says Aussie over here on a 6.4% IPA or five grams per liter on a hoppy pale ale. Uh, he said, I just did a pH of a finished beer and it was 4.7. So I would try adjusting that pH down um, to see uh, how those beers come across uh, once you hit food safe range. Um, I know some people like their pH higher, some people like their pH lower on those beers, um, but I know there are some people that uh, really love having a lower pH uh, on those beers because remember those hops are going to be drawing up the pH of your beer, especially at those more aggressive dry hop levels. You know, I don't think there's any big problem with, with the process. Um, I would say, you know, if you are on the homebrew side, um, I, I don't have a huge problem with the, the contact time that you're utilizing, but maybe give it a rouse or two. Um, you're using a, a smaller fermenter. Maybe you can swirl it, a rocket, something like that. Get those things, uh, keep those things up in solution a little bit. And that might give you that that might help you in that direction as well. So, yeah, take a look at the water a little bit and then uh, maybe look at getting those hops roused a little bit and see if you can pop those a little bit more. I might dial back that that sulfate lean, lean off that gypsum, man. Go one to one and uh, uh, go one to one. Uh, get about 100 parts of 75, 100 parts of chloride sulfate in it and, you know, 50 to 100 parts uh, calcium. And, and then kind of see what you're see what you're looking at. Appreciate the question, dude. All right, everybody, thank you so much for watching. If you feel as if you got any value out of the video, please like and subscribe. There are also other videos that you can watch. They're gonna maybe be over here, or over here. Appreciate you watching.